Today we are going to study changing paper to isometric, drawing in isometric, filling in a shape with colour. First of all we need to change our paper to isometric grid. Go to grid, double click, go to isometric, click, press OK and the paper will change to isometric grid. Now we can draw a simple cube. Remember, hidden lines are dotted lines. So go to the line command, click and select dotted lines for hidden lines. Click OK. Your line is now a dotted line. And you can join up dotted lines. Go back to line. Go back to a solid line. Click OK. Before we've practiced in isometric, today I'd also like you to try and draw uh, a few letters or your name in isometric using the isometric grid. Here's an example of the first letter of my surname. Notice that because I've got the gridlock on, it's quite easy and quickly to draw a three dimensional object. If I took the gridlock off, I would be drawing freehand isometric, and that's really quite difficult. Okay. Hope you can see the image. Now, the third part filling in a shape with colour. We go to bound fill and click. Go to colour, select a colour, a light colour for the back. Click OK, click OK. And these areas at the back, I can find it, I'll click more. I will fill in the light colour. For the front, I'm going to fill this area in a darker colour of blue. Simply, that's the way we can create an isometric view of the letter H and our cube. 